The National Human Rights Commission says voting for its third edition of annual awards starts November 12 as part of its International Human Rights Day commemoration. The Executive Secretary of the Commission, Mr. Tunio Juku, speaks extensively on this. You recall that we began this journey in December 2019 and since then, through the participation of Nigerians, we have recognized icons in our midst that play a significant role in the realization, promotion, protection and enjoyment of human rights in our country. Since 2019, state governments, civil society organizations, as well as individuals have won the Distinguished Human Rights Awards. These awards are in realization of the fact that the human rights situation in the country, despite these daunting challenges, can maintain a steady improvement if individuals and organizations are encouraged to do more by appreciating their efforts in advancing the cause of human rights in the country. The Commission, therefore, deems it very crucial to encourage federal government agencies, state governments, and civil society organizations to continue to advance the promotion and protection of human rights in Nigeria in order to have better and egalitarian society, void of all forms of human rights violations, and a people imbued with the culture of respect for democratic norms and social justice. It is against this backdrop that we are bringing together government agencies, civil society organizations, the United Nations entities, and the media to be part of this third edition of the annual National Human Rights Awards, scheduled to take place on 10th December 2021, as part of the activities to mark the 2021 International Human Rights Day. Ojuku states the categories for the awards and indicators. The indicators for selecting deserving MDAs for the award include the following. The impact of the MDA's work in the enjoyment of human rights in Nigeria. Two, the level of compliance of the MDA to court judgments. This is very important for us. Three, the degree of accessibility of the MDA services to the public. Four, the extent to which the MDA complies with 5% employment ratio for persons with disability. Five, the impact of MDA's work or contributions in promoting social justice and eliminating discriminatory attitudes and practices. The domain address again is www.nhrcawards.ng. The domain address is www.nhrcawards.ng.